know, so we got love call messages. We got grudge. We got ending. And then we got sleepless nights. So, Leo, there is someone that is getting ready to contact you. Whoever this is that's getting ready to contact you, Leo, this person, I feel like you're mad at them. I feel like you guys are definitely holding some form of resentment towards this person, Leo. And it's crazy because even though they're contacting you, Leo, your person knows that you're mad at them. Your person still continue to contact you, still continue to contact you, and you're mad at them. And a lot of you guys could be upset because you cannot rest. Maybe you having a lot of sleepless nights. It's like the more angry that you are, the more hurt that you are, the more you're not able to get no sleep. I am getting that energy with the sleepless nights right here, Leo. And the only reason why your person contacting you right now is because something has ended on their end with somebody else. So we're going to clarify and see what's going on. Because I feel like you guys are definitely pretty much pissed off at this person, Leo. And it's sitting here still calling you and texting you. However they're contacting you, Leo, is really making you mad. Because it's like y'all having a hard time already trying to rest, trying to get some sleep. And they just got a nerve to sit here and blow you up. Because some of y'all's person could be blowing you up. Or they just keep contacting you, you know what I'm saying? But it is saying that they only doing it because somebody else, in, you know, left. But we got the page of cups. So some of you guys, this person has something to say, right? We got the, the king of swords. So it's like the more they try to get you to come back, the more you, sh you shut it down. With this king of swords reverse. You shut it down. And I just felt like no matter what they say, Leo... You don't take this person serious anyway. Some of y'all feel like this person is lying to you. Some of y'all feel that way. We got the high priestess reverse, and then we got the fool. Wow. Some of y'all may have found out that this person was in love with somebody else, and that could be the reason why you could be so upset, Leo. Or maybe you tell, okay, maybe you tell them you found out, Leo, about another person. It's like whatever that's coming out of their mouth, it's a lie. Page of Cups, King of Swords, Reverse, it's a lie. Because you found out something with this high priestess, Leo. And it's crazy because, I, like I said, this person knows that you are mad at them. Some of y'all still do love this person. Maybe you could be mad at them, you know, holding some form of resentment towards them. And at the same time, you still could have love for this person. But let's clarify. Let's clarify. But I feel like somebody in this situation is just not real. They're not solid. They're not to be trusted. And it's the, it's the person that's coming back. Some of y'all's person could be telling you that the person that they had an ending with in the background, they could be saying that that person left them. But I don't know why I'm getting this energy. Just whatever they're saying to you, Leo, they, it's just, they're just trying to get you to come back. See this person with the legs right here? And they just sitting there looking up at the legs. Whatever they saying to you, it, 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 they just trying to get you to come back. But you feel like you you don't want to talk to this person. Some of y'all just flat out don't want to talk to this person. Whatever they say, you feel like it's a lie. It's like you've seen this person for who they really is, Leo. Although some of y'all still could be in love with this person. But at the same time, just pissed off. That's the energy that I'm getting from this person. Dang, we got the king and the queen of swords reversed. So they sitting here lying and you sitting here cussing them out. Some of y'all are cussing this person out. Some of y'all's person could be trying to like literally tell you that they love you. But you just don't, you don't believe it. You don't believe it. You don't believe it. Yeah, they sitting here lying, trying to manipulate the situation to get to get you to come back, and you sitting here cussing them out at the same time. This is crazy. But it is saying that something has been revealed, something has been exposed, um, Leo. 
Wow. Page of Pentacles. Listen, the more you cuss this person out, the more they want you. We got the Page of Pentacles. Some of y'all's person is begging their way back in. They begging their way back in, Leo. Some of y'all's person could be trying to give you something, maybe a couple of dollars or something. I don't know. But you cussing them out, probably call them every name in the book. They still want you back. It's like no matter how many times, Leo, that you cuss them out, you call them names, you whatever you say, right? They still want you. They still want you back, Leo. Now, some of y'all could be the bad guy on this end. You know what I'm saying? And dogging this person out, and they still want you. Because I am seeing that also. Some of y'all, y'all could be the bad boy or the bad girl on the end. And this person doing everything in the book to get you back, saying everything in the book to get you back, but you just dogging them out. Some of y'all, that could, that could be the case. I'm just being honest. I'm seeing this too. All these pages and cups and... Page of Pentacles, Page of Swords, Page of Cups. Yeah, this is staying serious. This is somebody you definitely cannot take serious. Some of y'all, this could just be somebody younger than you. Or this could be the other way around. Maybe maybe you are the young one and they're the old head. But I am getting that energy. This could be somebody a little bit younger than you, Leo. It's like no matter how they tell you how they feel, no matter, or we're going to say, no matter who tell. Okay, why can I say this? I don't know what side you are. No matter what somebody say in regards of how they feel no matter what they offer them no matter what they say to them it's like i hope this ain't no bad card let me clarify page of sword because I'm, I'm strongly getting somebody is trying to beg their way back in no matter how vulnerable that they are towards the other person that other person ain't trying to hear it nine of swords And I strongly feel like the other person feels like that person is nagging because they can't sleep on the other side. So we got one person doing whatever, saying whatever they got to say in order to get you to come back. Or this could be the other way around. Somebody is doing and saying whatever they need to say and do in order to get the other person to come back. But the person that's upset, that's pushing them away, that don't want them to come, whether they do or not. The person that's upset, that's have they they can't even sleep, they can't even think, they is so much anxiety. So it's like the more somebody push up on somebody, the more fearful somebody becomes. That's the energy that I'm getting, and it's like they had to go out their way to cuss this person out and call them every name in the book in order for them to get away, and they still won't leave. That's the energy that I'm picking up on. I ain't off. I think I had a reading like this one time at the beginning when I first started doing tarot, but this is rare that I see this. What's up with all these pages? Maybe somebody got multiple people doing this. Maybe you got a lot of young bucks doing this, reaching out to you, begging for you for your attention for your attention, um, Leo. Because we got one, two, three, four pages. That's all the pages in the day. That's exactly what I'm seeing. Some of y'all could be dealing with a lot of young bucks. That's what I'm getting. Some of y'all dealing with like at least three or four young bucks. And they all do the same thing to you. And it's like when they reach out to you, or it could be one person in particular. Like I said, y'all just take high resonate because it's different for everybody. If it's one person in particular, they doing this. That's exactly what I'm seeing. And they will literally mess around with this person no matter how much they dogged them out. Did not say that. They will even have sex with this person no matter what. Like, that's the energy. Did not say deception. This is somebody that you've been in it with a long time ago, Leo. Somebody been in it a long time ago. Some of y'all could even be trying to pay this person to get away from you. That's how crazy this is. Like, I don't know if they're crazy, but, or they just fell too hard for the other person, but y'all will literally pay this person to leave you alone. Because I strongly feel like the more they push up on you, you know, 
the more fearful somebody become, like the more anxiety that they get. You know what I'm saying? Even if they're not in fear, I just feel like the anxiety is is making them be in fear because somebody is like chasing after them and the other person is running. I'm getting this chaser and runner energy, Leo. Because I feel like somebody has already expressed how they really felt about the other person and fell in love. You know what I'm saying? And the other person don't want to be bothered because of these thoughts and these anxiety that they have. So the other person ain't trying to hear it. See, if somebody confessed they love to the other person, whether they have done this, said something to you about how they felt, or it could be the other way around. But I am seeing that. Some of y'all could be telling this person you to replace them. Maybe you could be telling this person you found somebody new. And maybe you have somebody that's taking care of you. Some of y'all found somebody new, or this could be the other person saying this, that they got somebody else that's taking care of them, giving them what they want, giving them what they need. You know, say, I'm telling y'all, somebody is saying and doing any and everything to get this person off of their tail. You see what I'm saying? So it's like no matter how somebody get dogged out, how no matter how, no matter what they say, it's just if if you pay them to get away, <laughs> they probably won't get away. Yeah, this is somebody single. We got the bachelorette. Whether this is a man or a woman. But it is saying that somebody literally tried everything in the book to get some get rid of somebody and they still just won't leave them alone. Told them they already found somebody else and everything. You know what I'm saying? But I just feel like y'all don't want to talk to this person, Leo. This person fell too hard. We got the two of wands. Yeah, y'all planning to make moves somewhere else, Leo. Y'all are cross watcher. You could be cross watching. But somebody is making moves elsewhere and ignoring that other person that keep on, you know, pushing up on them to give them attention and love them or reach out, whatever the case may be. Yeah, it's because they already got somebody. They ignoring this person because they already got somebody who's reliable. They already have somebody that's taking care of them. That's exactly what I'm saying. Or they taking care of them the other way around. But it is saying that somebody is, they got plans elsewhere. But the other person that's pushing up on them, they planning to, you know, they want to focus on y'all working things out, but the other person ain't trying to hear it. They ignoring them. Because they eyes are somewhere else. And I feel like somebody is being flat out honest and truthful to the other person. They getting on their nerves. That's crazy. Some of y'all, this it could be somebody trying to confess their love to you, Leo, but you ain't trying to hear it because you don't want them. You see what I'm saying? I am getting that. Yeah, y'all about to cut off communication ASAP. Y'all, y'all, y'all cutting this person off. Whoever this is, they can't seem to get up, give up. But I am getting that energy where somebody y'all, some of y'all about to cut this person off, like literally cut off communication, because they keep chasing after you and you just not with that. But it is saying that this is somebody you ended it with a long time ago. That's probably why we got ending right here. This is somebody you ended it a long time ago, and they still on your, y'all already know, on your job. They still on it. We got psychic abilities. Maybe you knew this person was going to come back. Some of y'all knew this person was going to come back. But somebody could be very much psychic. Their third eye could be open. You know. One more card. We got beauty. Hmm. This person really believed that y'all are supposed to be together. I don't know why, but I'm getting this, um, this person really, I don't know why I'm just keep hearing this person believe that y'all supposed to be together with psychic abilities and beauty. Somebody is going to be forced to take a hardcore look at themselves. Literally. I'm going to be honest. Some of y'all, maybe y'all just not attracted to this person. Some of y'all feel that way. We got beauty right here. Maybe this person knows that and they still keep trying to push up on you. Maybe you're not physically attracted to this person anymore. Or maybe you never was. Because they're not your type. Some of y'all's person is not your type. 
It don't even have to be just their looks, maybe just their personality. Like I said, they just being desperate and and it's causing you to run away from them, basically. But I'm going to go ahead and end it right here, Leo. I hope it resonates with you guys, and y'all take care.